welcome to Polymer Update. This is Simran Chaudhary and you're watching Polymer Update TV, the only TV in the world with a daily petrochemicals news show. Our sponsor for today is Ahmedabad based AccuWeb Enterprises, a manufacturer of protogravure, printing machines, lamination, coating machines, sitter reminders, core cutting machines, stretch wrapping machines, doctor and inspection machines, inkjet reminders and inspection machines. Let's start with energy news. Crude oil futures edged lower on Tuesday after the American Petroleum Institute reported an unexpected gain in U.S. fuel inventories. WTI traded at $68.53, a fall of $0.34 cents per barrel, while Brent finished at $75.95, down $0.26 cents per barrel. According to Vandana Hari of Vanda Insights, crude futures were trading in a narrow range either side of Tuesday's close early Wednesday in Asia. After the American Petroleum Institute reported a surprising, albeit small build in U.S. crude stocks for last week. Crude prices movements in the coming hours could be limited as the market awaits the official stocks data from the Energy Information Administration due out later Wednesday. Open spec NAFTA prices meanwhile on Wednesday is up by 6 US dollars per metric ton at the 667 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Let's take a look at futures at China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today on August 29th, 2018. LNTPE prices are higher by 5 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 9,555 RMB per metric ton. PP rates remain steady from the previous settlement at 9,910 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are down by 5 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 7,000 RMB per metric ton. In clan news, Petrochemical Corporation of Singapore has resumed operation at its cracker late last week. The cracker was shut on July 12, 2018 for a maintenance turnaround. Located at Jurong Island in Singapore, the number one cracker has an ethylene production capacity of 450,000 metric ton per year. Polymer Update has come up with monthly automobile industry insights for India as a value addition for its customers. The monthly report prepared by our in-house experts provides a 360-degree overview of the local automobile industry, including regulatory issues, technological development, key international issues and latest trends affecting the industry. Visit polymerupdate.com to download the detailed report. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. It's Wednesday, August 29th. This is Simran Chaudhary. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash polymerupdate and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at polymerupdate. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.